everybody and once again welcome to fresh fire prayer ministry so we keep the fire of the holy spirit burning today is the day the lord has made we will rejoice and be glad in it i think today is the 12th day of our 40 days fasting and prayer if you're able to fast with us today just type yes and may god continue continuously bless you and grant you grace as you embark on this 40 days fasting may it be filled with divine intervention god's blessing god's help god's assistance god's favor god's grace may whatever you are trusting and believing god for may god answer you speedily in the name of jesus you can also type what country or what state or what region you are or province that you are joining us from and may the lord locate you even tonight and may the lord answer you speedily in the name of jesus Somebody joining us from switzerland texas Birmingham, uk new york atlanta nigeria maryland florida all over may god richly bless you for connecting australia we have australia also with us texas may god denmark so please uganda zimbabwe atlanta bahamas so please whenever you come on you are connecting with your christian brother sisters pakistan from all over the world you are not alone you are not the only one ghana you are not the only one calling on god <laughs> you you just got to know that <laughs> you are not the only one it's not monopoly it's not monopoly uh, i just my god god has other sons and you have other brothers and sisters all over the world and today we can see through the venue of uh, in social media that you have brothers in california mauritius brothers in ohio bahamas san diego Trinidad, Tobago, all over. So that's what the Bible says. When we pray, we should say our South Africa, South Africa, Ireland. That's why whenever we are praying, the Bible says we should say our Father. Never say, no, 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 God is not just your God. He has other children. And that's why we have to be always aggressive in our prayer because you are not the only one asking from God. He has many other children all over the world who are also placing demand on his attention connecticut may god bless you all kansas may god bless you all and grant your heart desire in the name cc nati cc nati may god bless you saint martin may god richly bless you and grant your heart desire whatever you are believing god for whatever you are trusting god for lango kebi may god bless you and preserve and protect you and your family new hampshire may god all my sustain us so we thank him and we bless him today we'll be dealing with a topic which has been plaguing a lot of us. The last time we had a conference, I was surprised the number of people who were having issues in these areas. So God said the best time to address this issue is during the time of fasting. The best time to deal with this issue is during the time of fasting and prayer, because that's when you have the sufficient grace and strength to be able to uh, confront and defeat the strong man and bind and cast him out of your life in jesus mighty name but before we start any deliverance any warfare prayers i want you to join me to worship to glorify to magnify to exalt to adore to enthrone to extol the god of all creations our kinsman redeemer our strong fortress our light and salvation our hope, our eternal rock of ages, our Lord and Master, Jesus Christ. Let's glorify him. Let's magnify him. Let's exalt him. Let's enthrone him. Let's let him know that we appreciate everything he is and has been and is about to do for us. We are so grateful. We are so appreciative. We are so content with having him as our Lord and Master Savior. To him alone be all the glory, honor, and praise. Lift up your voice with me right now and say thank you jesus thank you holy spirit thank you blessed father blessed be your holy name hallelujah bless the name of the lord bless the name of the lord bless the name of the lord bless the name bless the name of the lord jesus Mekata di kitos, ratata bedeketos, 
Mantone Mikarabos, Repam Palibidibos, Uranda da Bidibis, Capta Ladaros, Rata Tadis, Ranta Lelesian Dalelis, Rentan Delelesian Talelis, Rentan Delelesia Talelis. We bless your name, Jesus. We bless your name, Jesus. We glorify your name, Jesus. We glorify your name, Jesus. We magnify your name, Jesus. We magnify your name, Jesus. We exalt your name, Jesus. We enthrone your name, Jesus. We celebrate you, Lord Jesus. We say, we proclaim you are God, you are king, you are sovereign. You rule with power, might, and there's no God comparable to our God. Blessed be the name. Blessed be the name. Blessed be the name. Blessed be the name. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you for life. Thank you for health. Thank you for protection. Thank you for preservation. Thank you for sustenance. Thank you for grace. Thank you for lavishing upon us and bestowing upon us your overflow of your blessing. Thank you for peace. Thank you for joy. Thank you for sound mind. Thank you for being our protector, our defense. Rapapa de Bredos, Rapapa Lebreros, Yatale, Lesia, Kaleko, Remazuka, Randelevos, Mantinimos, Mapunimia, Hinalusia, Patifitoski, Pinalia, Mantunipuniata, Lacuriatas. We worship you, Jesus. We glorify you for helping us, sustaining us. We thank you for how far you have brought us this year. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. We bless you, Jesus. That everything that has blessed, everything that has breath, everything that has breath, everything that has breath, praise the name of the Lord. Let everything that has breath, whatever has breath, let it praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord God Almighty for his worthy. He is worthy. Jesus is worthy. Jesus is worthy. Jesus is worthy to receive all the praise and honor and glory. Payabas, kapaya, melelo, segede, vavavos, papapa, propoposiande, rada de dosia, meke vedosa, brada da kuka, yada da dia, rampa le bonze vendol, and kalanzu pindalaya. We worship you. You are worthy. You are worthy. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord Jesus. The Bible says, for all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. If we say we are without sin, we deceive ourselves and that the truth is not in us. Joshua said to the Israelites as they were about to cross over or move to the next level, he says, I sanctify yourself, consecrate yourself. For tomorrow, God is about to do amazing things in our lives. I believe during this season of fasting and praying, God is moving in our midst to do amazing, 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 awesome, magnificent, incredible, wonderful things. But we need to make sure we have position and align ourselves according to his word and his ways so that we don't forfeit or miss out on his blessing for us. So we need to make sure we consecrate ourselves and we have to pray and ask him for mercy and forgiveness the bible says if we say we are without sin we deceive ourselves and that the truth is not in us however if we confess our sins it's faithful and just to forgive us and to cleanse us from all our unrighteousness god is a merciful father the stainless blood the stainless sinless blood of jesus christ spotless blood of christ is able to wash you and i from all our filth, all our sins, all our transgression, all our iniquities, everything that we've done against God and his word, the blood is able to cleanse us. If only we will repent, if only we will turn away from our evil ways, if only we will confess our sins. I want you to go before the presence of God, even right now, right here, and say, Lord, have mercy on me. Lord, forgive me. Lord, I repent. Lord, I'm sorry. Lord, pardon me. Wash me with the precious blood of Jesus Christ. Create in me, O God, a clean heart 
a new and a right spirit within me. Have mercy. Have mercy. The Bible says, let's come boldly to the throne of grace that we may receive mercy and find grace in times of need. Let's pray for mercy. 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 The mercies of God. 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 We pray for mercy. We pray for forgiveness. We pray for cleansing. Oh Lord, have mercy on me. Oh Lord, wash me. Oh Lord, cleanse me. Oh Lord, purge me. Let the precious blood, the sinless, spotless blameless blood of Jesus Christ cleanse me from everything I've said, I've done, I've thought about any actions, reaction, inaction that doesn't glorify you. I pray for mercy and forgiveness. I pray for mercy and forgiveness. I pray for mercy and forgiveness. Forgive me of my sins. Forgive me of my transgression. Forgive me of my iniquities. Forgive me of my shortcomings. Every area of my life compromise i've rebelled i have resisted the holy ghost i have not walked in the path of righteousness i pray for mercy on my behalf on the behalf of my wife on behalf of my sons and daughters on behalf of fresh families members father have mercy on us lord be merciful lord cleanse us lord be merciful lord cleanse us lord be merciful lord cleanse us from all our sins from all our transgressions we repent oh god we repent oh god if my people are called by my names who humble themselves and pray and turn away from their evil ways, then will I hear them from heaven and forgive and forgive them and heal their land. Oh Lord, we come humbly before you. Oh Lord, show us your mercy. Oh Lord, be, com- be merciful to us. Let the blood cleanse us. Oh Lord, lead us in the path of righteousness. Oh Lord Almighty, help us to worship you in truth and spirit. Oh Lord Almighty, forgive, forgive 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 do not deal with us according to our sins do not deal with us according to our transgression for your mercies you are a merciful father and your mercy endure forever and ever you are abundant in mercy but your judgment and your anger is for a moment but your mercy is for everlasting we pray oh god for thy mercies for as far as the east is from the west so we ask you to blot away our sins blot away our transgression blot away in our iniquities and set us on the trajectory of righteousness, holiness, purity, and decency. Help us, O Lord, to live for you. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy. Thank you, Jesus. We want to pray and ask the Lord to baptize us, to fill us up with his Holy Ghost and with his power. I realize in this world, without the Holy Spirit, you can do nothing. If God has not empowered you, if God has not strengthened you, even simple things can defeat you. Simple things can destroy you. It takes the power from on high, the power of the Holy Ghost, the power of the Most High God to strengthen us, to help us, to comfort us, to to, to, to give us clarity and to give us guidance. It takes the Holy Spirit to be able to embolden us and refresh us, nourish us, and to, and, and to uphold us when we feel discouraged, when we feel beat down, when we feel hopeless, when we feel alone, when we feel like everything is against us, we feel exhausted. It takes the empowerment. He, he restored my soul. He restored my soul. He leaded me in the path of right. He restored. It is the Holy Spirit that restored our soul. It is the Holy Spirit that strengthens you when you are weak. It is the Holy Spirit that comforts you when you are discouraged. It is the Holy Spirit that begins to guide you and guide you and lead you and gives you clarity and begins to give you hope. It is the Holy Spirit that empowers you to keep on pressing on when sometimes we feel like giving up or we are bombarded with barrages of issues it takes the holy ghost begin to pray lord in the name of jesus baptize me with your holy ghost and with your power fresh oil fresh fire fresh anointing fresh oil fresh fire holy ghost power holy ghost power holy ghost power fresh oil lord fresh oil lord fresh oil lord fresh oil lord fresh fire fresh power fresh anointing rabasika mendolevea Repa palika, rapa scubria, remba tusa, rapa katus, rakataka, makulikata, makuriakata, marokatia, mazuka prika, reba kuka skea, rapa bandus, rapa shenka, mendevedoska, bakuka laka, bakuri kataika, mazuka talika, reba skipela, mazupa, rapa peaba, rapa palia, rapa tunimia, repa palebe, repa polebe, rekataya de, rapa. Rapa papa, rapa papas, rapa papa, rapa palavis, rapa tefe, rapa sheka, rapa ponte, menton toske, rapa pantage, rapa sketes, rapa toilet, rapa denske, 
Refentoske te Rapankora Refentoske Repashata Holy Ghost Power Holy Ghost Fire Holy Ghost Power Holy Ghost Fire Fresh Oil Fresh Fire Fresh Power Fresh Onshin Fresh Onshin Fresh Onshin to function extra oil extra grace extra oil extra grace great grace from above mele de dos 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 mikataya rakataya mazukata rekakote rapashanda may the lord strengthen you may the lord strengthen you may the lord empower you may the lord empower you may the lord embolden you May the Lord embody you. May the Lord energize you. Be energized. Be rejuvenated. Be rejuvenated. Be revamped. Be revamped by the power. Be refreshed. Be renourished. Be renourished. Be renourished. Be nourished. Be nourished. Be nourished. Be refreshed. Be refreshed in His presence. Be refreshed in His presence. In His presence, there is liberty. Receive fresh oil. Receive fresh grace to carry on, to press on, to move on. Reba scatter, leaving the past behind and pressing on. Looking be looking forward and not looking backwards in the name of Jesus. Receive uh, the Holy Ghost to catapult you into your next level, into your next height. Uh, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray and soak yourself, saturate yourself in the blood. Soak yourself in the blood, soak your children in the blood, soak your family in the blood, soak your loved ones in the blood, soak your grandchildren in the blood soak your brothers and sisters your parents your loved ones soak your house in the blood your apartment in the blood your car in the blood you're going out and coming in in the blood plead the blood of jesus plead the blood of jesus as your protective covering let the blood preserve and protect us and secure us in christ that no weapon formed or fashion against us shall prosper no atrocity no calamity no misfortune no tragedy will be able to locate us to do us any harm because we are covered by the blood in, of Jesus, begin to cover your your family, your children. Somebody begin to pray for your children. Cover them in the blood. Cover your husband in the blood. Cover your marriage in the blood. Cover your body, soul, and spirit in the blood. Reba bada bada, reba da bados, 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 reba da bados. I plead the blood. I plead the blood. I plead the blood. I plead the blood. I plead the blood on this prayer platform. I plead the blood on this prayer platform. I plead the blood on this prayer line. I plead the blood over your body, soul, and spirit. I plead the blood over my body, over my soul, over my spirit, over my wife, over my children, over your family, over your children, over your husband, over your wife, over your entire family. We plead the blood. We cover our houses. We cover our apartment. We cover our vehicles, our cars. We cover our our communities in the blood, our loved ones in the blood, our parents, our brothers and sisters, our cousins and niece and nephews and in-laws. We cover our family members in the precious blood of Jesus. We plead the precious blood. We plead the precious blood. We plead the precious blood. Rebaskete vendos. Makapalo kotose. Rabashanda labadusa. Rebadusika laba. Let the blood preserve us from every tragedy, every calamity, every misfortune, anything that will jeopardize our lives and our work with God. Anything that will infiltrate to destroy us. We plead the blood against every witchcraft attack, every demonic attack, every spirit of death and destruction, every sickness and diseases, every arrows, every dart, every yokes, every spells, every voodoo. We plead the blood. I plead the blood. I plead the blood. The blood of protection. The blood of protection. The blood of Jesus. Let the blood keep you. Let the blood keep us. Let the blood preserve us from all evil. In the name of Jesus. Rabba Sukha Brande Lebo Shandalaba. I want you to pray this prayer. Father, let the blood of Jesus blind my enemies. Let it blind. Whoever is monitoring you right now, whatever demon is monitoring you right now, let the blood blind them. Let the blood of Jesus blind them so that they can't monitor you anymore. Let the blood of Jesus blind every monitoring spirit. Let the blood blind, blind, blind. I blind. I blind every monitoring spirit. I blind every monitoring demon. I blind every witch. I blind your eyes. I blind you. In the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus, I command your eyes to be blinded. I blind every monitoring mirror, every monitoring device, gadget, every surveillance instrument being used to monitor you. We blind it, we blind it, we blind it, we break it, we destroy it. In the name of Jesus, I blind any human personality. I blind every animal, every bird, 
every insect, every animal being used to monitor you. Let them be blinded. Let them be blinded. Let them be blinded by the blood. I strike them by the power in the blood of Jesus. Rabas kata brakatos. Rabas kata rabas kotos. Let every witch, every wizard, every wicked person who is monitoring your movement, who is monitoring your movement, let their crystal ball break right now. Let their magical mirrors break right now. Let every devices they are using to monitor you break in the name of Jesus. Whoever is monitoring you with their eyes, we command blindness by the blood of Jesus. Let them be blinded. We blind them. We blind them. We pierce their eyes to be blinded. We pierce their evil eye. We pierce their evil eye. We pierce their evil eye. We blind their eyes in Jesus' name. By the blood of Jesus, let every evil eye be blinded. Every crystal ball, every mirror, everyone who is using any water, any cloth to monitor you, any monitoring gadget, any insect, any bird, any animal, any insect in your house around you that is monitoring you, let them be destroyed by the power in the blood of Jesus. Rakatakata, 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 Mazuka, 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 Mareke, Masheke Tarakus, in the name of Jesus. Let that animal die in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen and amen and amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Show me thy mercy. Show me thy mercy. And deliver me. And deliver me. From all my enemies. From all my enemies. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Have mercy on me. Have mercy on me. Jesus. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. When we read, can you, Matthew chapter 7 verse 21. Matthew chapter 7, verse 21. Matthew chapter 7, verse 21. Matthew 7, 21. Matthew 7, 21. Matthew chapter 7, verse 21. Can you read it? Not everyone who say to me, Lord, Lord, shall enter the kingdom of heaven, but he who does the will of my Father mm -hmm. in heaven. Verse 22. Many will say to me in that day, Lord, Lord, have we not prophesied in your name, cast out demons in your name, and done many wonders in your name? Continue. Verse 23. Are you, Matthew 17, 21. Matthew 17. 21. Matthew chapter 17. Matthew chapter 17. Verse Matthew 17, 20. Yeah, Matthew 17, 21. He said, however, this kind does not go out. This kind does not go out. Except by prayer and fasting. Except by prayer and fasting. These kind, there are certain kind of demonic oppression, suppression, repression, torment, harassment, frustration, that will not leave, that will not break, will not leave unless you are in the season of fasting and prayer, praying and waiting on the Lord. And then God begins to give you power to become stronger than the strong man. So you can now defeat and cast that spirit out or begin to overthrow or shut down and dislodge that spirit activity in your life it's very important that it is during the season of fasting and prayer that certain stubborn demons can be addressed and one of the spirits that are plaguing a lot a lot of people especially our sisters is the spiritual husband or spirit wife and then you keep on getting the same emails again and again. Uh, I don't know how I'm going to break myself loose and free from this spiritual husband. I've done everything. You have to know that they are very stubborn. They are very stubborn spirit. And it needs intensive, aggressive, violent confrontation. That's what I'm saying. You need to be ready to fight and to what exercise your authority 
in Jesus name and have sufficient power to now overthrow that spirit husband or spirit wife get it yes so today because we are fasting i want us to spend some time praying today you are going to exercise your power and authority as a child of god to now defeat that strong man to defeat what strong man i think matthew the same matthew chapter 12 verse 29 matthew 12 verse 29 you need to be able because god has given us power and we can defeat them but you must you must of necessity confront and it's a battle so if you're not willing to fight then forget it you must be ready to confront and fight david had to fight goliath he didn't just sit down and say oh god will do it and god is going to give me victory no he had to engage goliath and then defeat the giant and then he became victorious you got to engage and that's why it is time for fasting then every every day every day yeah. during this fasting you got to be addressing the spirit husband you have to address the spirit wife you have to fight it every single day during this 30 day 40 days fasting and by the time you realize that attacks have ceased that oppression has ceased because you are fighting you are fighting them and you are fasting and you are fighting you are fasting and fighting fasting and fast and fighting don't just say i'm fasting so it is going to go automatically you have to confront there are battles we only win by serious confrontation and this is the good time for you to say enough is enough i'm sick and tired of, of you you this unclean spirit you this filthy spirit you this strange spirit that has come around me it is time to pack your things and go away i didn't uh, you, you are i'm not I'm, I'm not married to you i don't know you from anywhere and how where however you came into my life i'm sending you packing and i hate you and i don't like you in the name of jesus you got to fight continue read matthew, matthew 12. 12 verse 29 mm -hmm. Or how can one enter a strong man's how house? How can you enter the strong man's house? And the strong man is a spirit husband, a spirit wife, incubus, sacabus, a spirit that has is claiming ownership to your life, your body, a spirit that takes pleasure, just coming in and violate and sleep with you at will, rape you at will, come in and, 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 and stop you from getting married, or sabotage every marital opportunity that comes your way, keeping you single, keeping you barren, keeping you unhappy in your marriage. Please, it is time to say enough is enough with this nonsense. Spirit husband, spirit wife. Today, I don't want to go into all the what they do. You already know it. You've already, today it is fighting. I'm here to fight you. I'm here to do what? Fight. fight. Uh, today, I'm here to fight. You can go and listen to our videos about who they are, what they do. We, Everybody's talking about it. It's all over the place. Here today, I just want to kick you out, out of my life, out of my, around me. I don't need you around. It is just fighting. Confrontation. Begin to continue. And plunder his goods. And how can you overcome this strong man and plunder and take back your liberty, take back your freedom, take back your marital glory, take back your peace in your marriage, take back your pregnancy, Take back your finances. Take back your monthly cycle. Take back your destiny from this oppressive, controlling, terrorizing, hindering spirit. How do you overcome it? Continue. Unless he first bind. Unless you first bind, bind up. You got to deal with the strong man. You got to arrest that strong man. You got to bind that strong man. But the Bible says you must be stronger. You must be what? Stronger. Stronger. That's why we are waiting on the Lord to give us. That's what the Bible says. Those who wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up on wings like eagle. They shall run and not be worried. They shall, those who wait upon, they shall renew. Strength is being renewed. Strength is being renewed. Some of you have to go on three days fasting, even within the 40 days fasting, and confront this strong man because this spirit has been, apparently, we have different levels. This spirit has been, apparently, there's what? different level. levels of spirit husband there is a spirit husband when they marry you they are so powerful and strong that anybody who dares to try and marry you they'll kill the person i've seen it before they will keep you single and they are so strong sometimes it could be a whole river a whole river body in a certain village or community 
that that river goddess because the people there worship it has married women there and then the, 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 the spirit is so powerful and if it has married a woman and you too you want to hey can you imagine you saying that you are going to marry a, a very noble powerful um, um, for instance when mandela divorced his wife many years ago and you you small boy you are going to say i'm going to marry winnie mandela or i'm going to marry the wife of bill clinton some people they are they are so high up there that even when they die, their widows remain widows because everyone that went into, in the book of Esther, anyone who went into the beauty pageant to be seen by the king after that time could not be, nobody could marry because the king cannot meet with you, this the virgin, for any ordinary person to meet with that virgin again. In the same way, anyone David knew as a concubine when he came back after Absalom had defiled them, nobody else could marry them. They kept on being single because they have been connected to the highest order in the same spiritual realms. There are certain demonic entities when they claim certain women as their spiritual, their physical wives or husbands, whatever it is. I'm telling you, if you any man who trespass to marry them, you are in for the to perform premature death. A lady, I know a lady, and she came to the conference in South Carolina. But just like some of you who always have excuses of not having time for deliverance, every time she comes for the conference, she will rush out because of work. Oh, you know, I, I would like to stay, but you know, I have to work. I have to do this. And then she, so she didn't she really, she really didn't get her full deliverance. Yes, she was desperate and wanting to get married. And she was in the US and she had dated and gotten involved in many men, but no man could marry her from the United States. So she said to herself, if I can't find anybody in this whole country to marry me, then I'm going all the way back to my own country. So she went all the way to her country somewhere in Cameroon and then went to scout out and find out some old childhood friend and say, hey, I'm available. Will you marry me? And the guy also says, hey, you are in America. I want to be in their country. So so the guy was not even just, you know, the guy said, okay, that, that's that, the daily bread. There's a, an opportunity given. And the woman says, I'm sick and tired of being single. She did not deal with her spiritual spouse and then went all the way to Africa somewhere to marry this man and then brought the man in. Now the man says that every now and then in the evening, she will start when they are sleeping. She will start screaming. She will start screaming. They are choking me. They are choking me. He they are choking me. And then she will scream. And then she will wake up. And they say, what is going on? And then he says that a man came to try to kill me or to suffocate me. And then they'll pray and then it will go away. So she was going through a different levels of attacks because she had violated the protocol of a spirit has married her and she was not supposed to be married. And out of desperation, she forced herself to get married. And now the spirit was coming for her to kill her because she had trespassed. She belonged to the spirit and she now has now invited a mortal man to come and ma marry her. The last time I heard from her, it wasn't from her anymore. In fact, one another conf conference, she showed up and said, Reverend Key, Reverend Key, this is my husband. This is the husband that I have married. I said, oh God, we thank you. We thank God that finally, in your desperation, you've married. But the next, after six months, the next time I got a phone call, it was the man. He said, Reverend K, do you remember me? I said, no, I don't remember. Who are you? He said, I'm the one we came to your conference in Charlotte, South Carolina or North Carolina, whichever, Charlotte, wherever Charlotte is. And I came, my wife introduced me to you. And I said, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember your wife. She used to be on the prayer line. And she used to, she came also to the conference and brought, uh, showed you to me. Yeah, yeah. Oh, with her. He says, I'm sorry. She's dead. What? My wife is dead. Why? How, how, what happened? Say so one night we are sleeping 
and the same attacks comes came again. The spirit husband came in, choking her, choking her, choking her. We I called the ambulance before they got in. She was dead. Her spiritual spouse was very jealous one. At that time, many times they, some of these spirits kill the man, but this time this spirit killed her for going to marry another person. At that time, so you see some men, women who they marry a man, then the man, the man will die. They marry another, the man will die. They marry another, the man will die because they are spiritually married to a spirit. And these spirits are very powerful in the spiritual realm. So if you trespass to marry them in the physical, then premature death. That's why you got to be discerning. It's not a relationship that you force yourself into. Sometimes God wants to spare your life and it's leading you away from certain man or certain woman. And you are forcefully, oh, no, no, I want to do it. Go ahead. You never know what the Holy Spirit have seen. That you, you don't even pray. You don't even fast. You are not strong and heavyweight. And you want to go and marry this person with a spirit. They will come for you. For her, they killed her because she had allowed herself to go and marry. But many times, it's the men who suffer. They can be killed. And many people, they will tell you, they married this person. And even in the Bible, there were people, women, who they, whoever married, they, they die. Whoever married, they die. And that's what they did. The, 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 the Pharisees came to Jesus Christ. That there was a woman who married almost five of his brothers, seven. seven of his brothers, brothers, and all of them keep on dying, dying. Even in the house of uh, Jess, uh, Judah, Judah had Judah had a, 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 a daughter-in-law. All the his sons who were married to this girl were dying. What I'm trying to say is that there's a spirit spouse, depending on what spirit is affecting that that, that person, it makes the attack fierce and many times sometimes when you go through that battle when people come around you they even threaten they even threaten sometimes they are nice enough to threaten you that don't go to this woman and that's why many times women get into the relationship or the men get into the relationship and the relationship is developing building and at a point you call the person they don't pick your phone call you call your person they don't want to deal with you anymore because they have been forewarned in their dreams that if you carry out with this relationship with this woman you will die they have revealed and you think the man is going to tell you i had a dream and in the dream i saw a spirit come to tell me that if i marry you i will die or i've i've been a spirit has been pursuing me to kill me in my dream whenever i see myself and you in my dream they will not tell you all they will do is they'll disappear and oh why why is this guy don't not picking my phone why is this guy sadly uh, left me? Why is this? No, they have been spiritually warned. You one day, one day, some of you who probably have gone through rejection and disappointment, you one day, when somebody leaves you, you just try and tell them, I understand, you don't want to come to, you don't want to have anything with me anymore. You don't want to be in the relationship anymore. But please, can you confide in me and tell me why you are not interested? Be, you just be honest to me and I'll be okay. And they'll tell you, some of the spiritual battles they have found themselves fighting just by association when that happens you need to ask the lord to make you stronger to deal with that strong man in your life that's what i'm saying there are varieties of the spiritual spouse there are varieties of the spiritual spouse and they read others too they marry you and what they do is that Anybody who tries to marry you will be bankrupt, will be impoverished, will struggle financially. The person will never know no money. They will. So, oh, you married and your husband was doing well. Your wife was immediately you married. His job started going down. His business started going down. Nothing is working, and suddenly everything financial is crippled. That is his punishment for marrying you. That is his what? His his his, his punishment. For marrying you others too you can go ahead and marry but when you marry you will have no peace because there'll be rivalry in that marriage you will have no peace forget it your husband loving you 
your husband cherishing you, your husband really taking care of you, there will be no peace. They will, you will marry, you go ahead and marry, but forget about peace. It will be constant headache, wars, abuse, beatings, emotional abuse, your husband cheating on you, your husband disrespecting you, your husband treating you like trash. That is your package because that is what the spiritual spouse says. Because I'm married to you, this is what you get. You can marry all right and have a, uh, tell people you are married, but forget about peace. This marriage, no peace. No peace. Others too, they marry you, they will keep you single forever. No man comes around you. And some also, when they marry you, you can... They, they, and this happens a lot to the celebrities. They will marry you as a woman. And they will even enhance you and empower you to be so successful, so prosperous, so doing so well, but you can't marry. You can date, you can have sex, you can, but you will never. And if, as I'm talking, if you look at certain celebrities in our world, they are very rich, they are very famous, but they will always tell you, I'm not married. Or they try to marry, it never works because that's their spiritual marriage. You can become rich, you can become a celebrity, you can become very influential, but you belong to me. No man comes around you. You can sleep around, you, you can have sex whenever you want to, you can date as you want to, but you will never marry. So, as I'm talking, if you are you 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 are you can spot many people who are good um, celebrities and women do great stuff but they will tell you marriage is not their thing because that is the, the, the kind of spiritual marriage they are dealing with others to you can marry you can even enjoy your marriage but i will not allow you to have children in this marriage in 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 in, in place of children i give you fibroid i'll give you what fibroid that's what you get for getting married so you all yours is you are married or, or 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 but you can't you can't be pregnant you can't be pregnant then the doctors are saying you have fibroid and all sort of things so there are different levels and then if it's a man who is spiritually married when you marry the, the a man who is spiritually who has a spiritual marriage a man who has spiritual marriage if you the woman marries him then forever and ever, you will take care of the man. You do what? Take care. He will not take care of you. He, he will, oh, he can be handsome. Take tall. Six packs. Oh, yeah, that's my husband. Yeah, everybody sees, uh, but he will not work. He will not fend for you. He will not take care of you. In fact, you can go back and come back and he's playing his games. You will bring the food, you eat all the food. He will not lift a finger. You will take care of him. And he will not even care for you. So you, you marry such a spiritual marriage man and you realize that you are the one. But as for my husband, he's not helping me. He's not taking care of me. I'm the only one doing everything. And all I need from him is to even show some love and encouragement me. But he doesn't care about me. He doesn't. And even the smile I give to him is using it to chase another woman. <laughs> I'm so tired. I've killed myself. I've done everything for this man. I don't know why. And you find yourself, because to keep the marriage, just taking care of the man. He will not even say thank you. He will not even say what? Thank you. He will not even say, I appreciate you. You'll be taking care of the man all your life. And he will be respecting you. And he knows you have nowhere to go because your joy is just unmarried. But he will not play the man's responsibility of protecting you, fending for you, and taking care. So in, in such a relationship, you become so tired because you find yourself doing everything. You find yourself like you are single. Only the name, I'm married, but nothing is going on because they will make even if it was working immediately he marries you stop working every burden you will pay the light bill you pay the electricity you will pay everything you will take care of his shoes you will take care of him you will support him and he after you have decorated him you will just use all your decoration to go and cheat on you and when you you try to open your mouth to talk about how come i'm doing all this for you and you are still cheating he will slap you some more and then you keep quiet and just keep on taking care of him 
because he has a spiritual spouse and you have married to him. It is deep, but I'm telling you the truth so that you can wake up and start praying. I can't go into details. These are things you get when you get a book, Emergency Prayers for My Restoration. I listed some of the things in, in this book, Emergency Prayers for Marriage Restoration. So if you want more information, get a book, Emergency Prayers for Marriage Restoration. You will get some prayer points. Also, this book, Consuming Fire for Fire, that's what we are going to use tonight to pray about it. And also learning to break covenant. Covenant is what initiates all this, the new book, Freedom from Generational Curse. With this, with this kind of issue, you will need all these materials to enhance and help you deal with it it's not easy but with god we can overcome amen say with god with god we can overcome we can overcome in the name of jesus in christ in the name of jesus christ so you can go to our website www.freshfireprayer.com www.freshfireprayer.com and get any of the ebooks uh and then start educating yourself but the main thing is be ready to confront be ready to fight not you got to be ready to fight that's why i'm inviting some of you who can make it who can make it to the Delaware conference? Come to the Delaware conference. Come early and take your position and 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 and, and let God empower you and deliver you from some of these things. The Delaware conference, God willing, is going to be next week Friday. Next week Friday uh, at eight thirty. Live Chapel International, twenty two Parkway Circle, Newcastle, Delaware one nine seven two zero. Come and take your front seat. Amen. Amen. <laughs> And then you, you live there breaking and having dominion over all these evil spirits and evil powers in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. So today we are just going straight to prayers. We are going to too many talking about spiritual husband, spiritual husband. Let's just begin to wage war against them in the name of Jesus Christ. The Bible says God has given us power. Luke chapter 19 verse 10. Let's go to Luke chapter 19 verse 10. Luke 19, verse 10, mm -hmm. it says, Luke 19, verse 10, for the Son of Man mm -hmm. has come to seek mm -hmm. and to save that which was lost. Luke chapter 10, verse 19, uh, I think 10, verse 19, talking about, I give you power oh, and authority, yes, Luke chapter 10, 10, 10 verse 19. 19. Luke chapter 10, verse 19. Please, those of you who have this book, Emergency Press of Marriage Restoration, you will get a prayer point at page 102, 100, uh, 103, 104, 105, all the way to 107. You will get some of the prayers there. And then also in this book, um, Consuming Fire for Fire, you also get the same prayers. Continue. Luke chapter 10, verse 19. Behold, I give you the authority to trample on serpents and scorpions and over all the powers of the enemy, and nothing shall by any means hurt you. Amen. 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 Giving us power and authority. Giving us power and authority. Today, we are going to just spend some time to pray. 10 prayer. I want you to pray aggressively, pray violently, pray fiercely. And let the devil know enough is enough. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Satan, you got to leave. You got to leave. You got to leave. You got to leave. So we're going to pray and trust God that today the power of this evil spirit, demonic spirit, will release you in jesus mighty name amen. amen say heavenly father heavenly father in the name of jesus in the name of jesus i ask you i ask to you give me to give me maximum anointing, maximum anointing maximum power maximum power and help me help me to defeat to defeat every strong man every strong man every strong woman every strong woman every deity every deity every evil spirit every evil spirit, every, evil spirit, every unclean spirit every unclean spirit, every spirit husband every spirit husband, every spirit wife every spirit wife, every altar every altar every agent of darkness every agent of darkness that has been married to me that has been married to me spiritually Virtually. Give me the power. Give me the power to defeat them. To defeat them in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. So the first prayer we are praying is 
I'm going to say it, and then you're going to say it after me, and we are going to pray it. We are going to do what? Pray. pray it. I've told you that these are stubborn spirits, and you got to be stubborn and more aggressive, more violent to get them out. Otherwise, they refuse to go. And it's like you trying to divorce a person, and the person says, I still love you. You kick them out. By the time you come back, they are in because they said, I'm still interested and I'm still loving you. You got to be aggressive in kicking them, evicting them because enough is enough. They are very stubborn. But go, you have to be stubborn than them. That's what the Bible says. You have to be stronger than the strong man. He's a strong man, but God has given you the ultimate power oh, and authority yeah. to kick them out. Say, I'm, I kick out. I kick out in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. I kick out. I kick out in Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Every spirit husband. Every spirit husband. Every spirit wife. Every spirit wife. Every incubus. Every incubus. Every succubus. Every succubus. Any unclean spirit. Every unclean any spirit. Any agent of darkness. Any agent of that darkness. That you are married to me. That you are married or to claiming me. Or claiming me. As your spouse. As your spouse. In the name. In the name. Of Jesus. Of Jesus. The son of the living God. The son of the living God. I bind God. you. I bind and you. Cast you out. And cast you out. I bind you. I bind you. And cast you out. And cast you out. I bind you. I bind you. And cast you out. And cast you out. Out of, out of my life. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. So the prayer is, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I command the all-consuming fire of God to burn down the meeting places of the marine kingdom against me in Jesus' name. Wherever they meet to plan to attack you, I am sending the Holy Ghost fire to burn down, to burn down, to burn down their meeting place. They meet and they said, Okay, let me go tonight and visit her in her sleep. They meet. They are, there's a meeting whereby they give them the instruction to come. But today, wherever their meeting is, for them to take counsel, to come and attack you and frustrate your life, we are going to the roots. We are going to the source. We are going to their meeting place. We are going to their camp. We are going to their kingdom to set the kingdom, the marine kingdom on fire. We are setting the marine kingdom, whether it's in the river, whether it is in the sea, whether it's in the lagoon, whether it's an altar in your mother's house, an altar. Many people think that every spiritual marriage is incubus and succubus. No, incubus and succubus is really given to the Western world. But many people from India, Mexico, Africa, and all over, many times it are, they are spirit, they, they are altars in our own family background. Spirit in the family or what our ancestors used to worship that have married us. It is not every spirit, every spiritual marriage that is incubus and succubus. Many altars, many shrines, many deities, they marry people, women in their bloodline. Also to agent of darkness, a witch can marry you. A witch can do what? Marry you spiritually. Also when you visit spiritualists, shamans, uh, psychics, witch doctors, voodoo priests and priestess, you go there for help. They will give you the help. If you are pretty and you are nice, when you go spiritually, they will marry you. You've gotten a, a link, a contact with a person. So don't, don't limit your experience to incubus and succubus. It may not be incubus and succubus, but you are going to pray that whatever evil spirit, whatever unclean spirit claims you as a wife or a husband, today we set their kingdom on fire and you are breaking yourself loose and free. If you learn to pray this prayer and pray it consistently, sometimes as you pray this prayer, they heighten their attacks and aggression against you so that you will keep quiet, you will be afraid, you will terrorize, and they will intimidate you to stop praying. But if you are consistent, it stops. If you are what? Consistent releasing the fire. That's what I'm saying. That if you want to be delivered, you don't come and say, Reverend K, whatever, I've done everything. You haven't done everything. You need to fight. You have to go deeper. Fight more. Pray more. Fast more. Read the Bible more. Resist them more. They will give up. Moses had to fight. It's like, it's like Pharaoh. They are like Pharaoh. You need to come after them again and again and again and again until finally you defeat them. You don't quit. If you quit, they'll keep you in bondage forever. But today, in the name of Jesus, say in the name of Jesus. 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 I claim victory. 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 I
Jesus' name, by the blood of Jesus, I claim victory. I claim victory over the spirit husband, over the spirit wife, over the spirit spouse, over the evil altars, over any deity. Over every day that is claiming me, that is claiming me as their spouse, as their spouse. I reject you. I reject in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I divorce you. I divorce in the name of Jesus. In the name of I Jesus. bind you. I bind in the name of Jesus. In the name of and Jesus. I cast you out. And I cast you out, out of my life. Out of my life. Out of my destiny. Out of my destiny. Out of my life. Out of my life. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Say this after me. Say in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. By the power. By the power. And the anointing. And the anointing of the Holy Ghost. Of the Holy Ghost. I command. I command the all-consuming fire. The all-consuming fire. I command. I command the all-consuming fire. The all-consuming fire of the Holy Ghost. Of the Holy Ghost to burn. To burn into ashes, into ashes. To, burn to burn into ashes, into ashes. Every, meeting place every meeting place of the marine kingdom of the marine kingdom of the spirit husband of the spirit husband of the spirit wife of the spirit wife. wherever your kingdom is wherever your kingdom is, I set it on fire. I set it on fire. I set it on fire. I set it on let fire. the Holy Ghost fire. Let the Holy Ghost let the Holy Ghost fire. Let the Holy Ghost consume fire. your kingdom. Consume your kingdom. Consume your kingdom. Consume your kingdom. Into, ashes. into ashes. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin let to pray. the fire of God let the fire of enter God. into their meeting place. Enter into their meeting enter place. Into their kingdom. In Enter into their and, kingdom, bend and bend down their altars, their altars bend down, bend down their, their covens, their covens bend, down bend down their meeting place, their meeting place in, the in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost fire. In the name of Jesus, begin to pray. I command the Holy Ghost fire to bend down every meeting place of the marine spirit, of the incubu spirit, of the sakabu spirit, of the spirit husband, of the spirit wife, wherever they meet to plan evil against me. Let their kingdom be consumed by fire. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I command every meeting place of the spirit husband, of the spirit wife, of the unclean spirit, married to me spiritually. Wherever you meet to plan evil against me, I set your kingdom, I set your COVID, I set your camp, I set your high places, I set your kingdom on fire in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, I command the all consuming fire of the Holy Ghost to burn down the meeting place of the marine kingdom against my life in the name of Jesus. Every altar in my mother's house, in my father's house that is married to me, let the altar catch fire burn into ashes catch fire burn into ashes catch fire wherever they meet wherever they meet wherever they meet to be given an assignment against me i set their meeting place whether it's in the lagoon whether it's in the river whether it is in the lake wherever it is in the sea whether it is in the rivers wherever it is in the ocean wherever their meeting place may be i set their kingdom of fire in the name of jesus i set their kingdom I said their kid. I said their kid. I said their kid. Rabba ba da ba da ba da ba da ba da ba da ba. I set your kingdom of fire. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I command fire. The Holy Ghost fire. The consuming fire. Hailstones of fire. Hailstones of fire. Thunder, lightning. Thunder, lightning, fire. Of God to burn, to burn, to burn down their kingdom, 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 to burn down their altars, 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 every altar, every altar, every altar in my mother's house, every altar in my father's house, that the spirit of that altar has married me and is holding me in bondage, in captivity. I command your altar to catch fire. Your altar, catch fire. Your altar to catch fire. Burn into ashes. Burn into ashes. Burn into ashes. Burn into ashes. Every incubus spirit, I command your altars in the ocean, in the rivers, in the lagoon, in the lakes, wherever, in the in the pools, wherever you meet, wherever you have made your camp, be consumed by fire. Be consumed by fire. In the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen. amen. Our next prayer.
I declare war by fire against the spirit husband and that spirit wife against me. I declare war. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I declare war. I declare war. I declare a holy 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 against war. any spirit husband. Against any spirit against husband. any spirit wife. Against any spirit wife. Against any demon. Against any demon. That is married to me. That's married to me. I declare war against you. I declare war against you. That you that evil spirit. You that evil spirit. That doesn't want me to marry. That doesn't want me to marry. You that evil spirit. You that evil spirit. That doesn't want me to enjoy peace. That doesn't want me to enjoy peace. In my marriage. In my marriage. You that evil spirit. You that evil spirit. That doesn't want me to be pregnant. That doesn't want me to be pregnant. In my marriage. In my marriage. You that evil spirit. You that evil spirit. That is causing my husband to maltreat me. That is causing my husband to maltreat me. You that evil spirit. You that evil spirit. That is impoverishing my 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 life and my husband. That is impoverishing my life and my husband keeping us in financial hardship and difficulty keeping us in financial hardship and difficulty. i declare war against you i declare war against i come you. against you i come against in the name of jesus in the name of jesus i come against you i come against you in the name of jesus you evil spirit you evil spirit you unclean spirit you unclean spirit you foul spirit you foul spirit that comes to sleep with me that comes to sleep with that comes to rape me that comes to rape that comes to steal my blessings that comes to steal my blessings i come against you i come against you in the name of jesus in the name of jesus i come against you i come against by the blood of jesus by the blood begin to wage I wage war against the spirit husband. I wage war. I wage war. I wage war. In the name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. I wage war against you. I wage war against you. I wage war against you. I overcome you in the name of Jesus. I overcome you by the blood of Jesus. I overcome you in the name of Jesus. I overcome you by the blood of Jesus. I overcome you in the name of Jesus. I overcome you by the blood of Jesus. You unclean spirit. You demonic spirit. You foul spirit. That defiles me. That afflicts me. That torment me. That harass me. That frustrates me. I overcome you in the name of Jesus. I overthrow you in the name of Jesus. I subdue you in the name of Jesus. I overthrow you by the blood of Jesus. I conquer you. I vanquish you by the power in the name of Jesus. By the power in the name of Jesus. By the power in the name of Jesus. Rabba Shata Labados. Rebada Bada 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 I overcome you. 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 In the name of Jesus, overcome that spirit husband. Overcome that spirit wife. In the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus. I overcome you. I overthrow you. I subdue you by the authority in Jesus' name. 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 Rabba Sataya. Reba Shata. Reba Sata. Reba Pala. Reba Paya. Reba Tenedos. Reba Tenedos. Raka Talaba. Reba Korea. Reba Shekete. Mantunimi Talaba. Mentolia Talaba. Retolia Talaba. Retolia Talaba. Retolia Talaba. Retolia Talaba. I overcome you, spirit husband. I overcome you, spirit wife. I overcome you, spirit husband. I overcome you, spirit wife. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. You spirit husband. You spirit wife. You spirit spouse. I overcome in the name of Jesus. I overcome by the blood of Jesus. I overcome in the name of Jesus. I overcome by the blood of Jesus. I'm not intimidated by you. I'm not intimidated by you. I'm not afraid of you. I overcome in the name of Jesus. I come up against you. Just as David overcome Goliath. Just as David overcome Goliath and came up against Goliath in the name of the Lord. He says, 
you come against me with spears and sword, but I come against you in the name of the Lord. You spirit husband, you spirit wife, you unclean spirit that is married to me. I overcome you in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus. I subdue you, I overthrow you, I vanquish you, I, I overcome you, I condemn you in Jesus' name. I subdue you in Jesus' name. I defeat you in Jesus' name. I conquer you by the blood of Jesus. For the Bible says, we overcome the devil. We overcame the devil by the blood of the Lamb. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. You will not rape me anymore. You will not frustrate me anymore. You will not harass me anymore. You will not subdue me anymore. You will not hold me in bondage anymore. I overcome you in the name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. I defeat you. I defeat you. I defeat you. I overthrow you. I kick you out. I kick you out. I kick you out. I kick you out. I, I supplant you out of my life. Out of my destiny. Out of me. In Jesus name. In Jesus' name. That's why you pray. Don't keep quiet. When you finish, you come and tell me, Reverend K, I don't know what to do. We are praying and you are sitting down keeping quiet. And you think the spirit husband is going to leave you. Please, stop joking. We don't have time for jokes. I'm here to help. That's what God says. Go and help those who want to help themselves. Go and hurt. Help those who want to hurt. Help themselves. There are people who are desperate. They, are, they want out. Others do they think that this thing will just go. You got to fight it. You got to confront it. You got to open your mouth. You go. You have to pray like crazy. You have to what? Pray like crazy. You have to be like a mad woman who wants his deliverance for you to kick that spirit out. And after this, you realize that they will not disturb you in the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. You spirit husband. You spirit husband. You spirit wife. You spirit wife. Frustrating my life. Frustrating my holding life. Me holding me in captivity. Holding me in bondage. Holding me in bondage. Tormenting my life. Tormenting my life. Frustrating, frustrating my life. Frustrating my embarrassing my life. Embarrassing humiliating my life. Humiliating my life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I bind you. I bind you. I bind, I bind you and I cast you out of my life. I bind you in the name of Jesus and I cast you out. I bind you and I cast you out. I bind you in the name of Jesus. I bind you. I bind you and cast you out. I bind you and cast you out. I bind you. 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 The Bible says, whatever you bind on that shall be bound in heaven. I bind you and cast you out of my life. I bind you and cast you out of my life. I bind you and cast you out of my life. I bind you and cast you out of my life. I bind you and cast you out of my life. I bind you and cast you out of my life. I bind you in chains. I bind you in fairness. I bind you in chains. I bind you in fairness. I bind you in chains. I bind you in fairness. I bind you and cast you out. 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 I cast you out. Rabba Shatta. Reba Shatara. Reba Shatara. Reba Shatara. Reba Shatara, I bind you, I bind you in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I bind you, you spirit husband, I bind you, you spirit wife, I bind you, you incubus, you succubus, you unclean spirit, you fast spirit, you water body spirit, I bind you and cast you out of my life, I bind you and cast you out of my life, I bind you and cast you out of my life, I bind you and cast you out of my life, I bind you and cast you out of my life, you can't stay with me anymore, you can't marry me anymore, you can't oppress me anymore. Anymore. You can't frustrate my life anymore. You can't cause miscarriage and divorce and separation anymore. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. See, I bind you and cast you out. I bind you and I cast you out. You spread that causes disappointment. You spread that causes disappointment. You spread that cause separation and divorce. You spread that causes separation and divorce. You evil spread that causes confusion and misunderstanding between me and my spouse. You evil spirit that causes confusion and misunderstanding. You spirit that is keeping me single. You spirit that is keeping me single. I bind you. I bind, I bind you. you. I bind, I bind you. you. I bind in the name of Jesus. In the name of I Jesus. bind you. In the name of Jesus. I bind you. I bind you. And I cast you out. I cast you out. I cast you out. I cast you out. Out of my life. In Jesus name. Out of my life. In Jesus name. Out. Out of my life. Out of my life. You have to be desperate. In Jesus' name. The Bible says, resist the devil. And you do what? Resist the you. devil. So I resist you. I resist you. You spirit husband. 
you spirit husband. You spirit wife. You spirit wife. You've been visiting me. You've been visiting me. In my sleep. In my sleep. You've been coming around me. You've been coming around me. You've been coming to touch me. You've been coming to touch me. You've been coming to rape me. You've been coming to You've been coming to violate me. You've been coming to Today I resist you. Today I resist you. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I resist you. In Jesus' name. I resist you. By the blood of Jesus. I resist you. In the name of Jesus. I resist. Begin to resist. I resist you. I resist you in the name of Jesus. I resist you by the blood of Jesus. I resist you in the name of Jesus. I resist you by the blood of Jesus. I resist you in the name of Jesus. I resist you by the blood of Jesus. I resist you in the name of Jesus. I resist you by the blood of Jesus. I cast you out of my life. I resist you. 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 Great husband. I resist you. Great wife. I resist you. In Kubu Sakabus. In Kubu which is a wizard. I resist you. I resist you. And cast you out. 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 I resist you. And cast you out of my life. Out of my life. Out of my life. Out of my life. I resist you. In the name of Jesus. Rabashata. Rabashata. Say you spirit. You spirit. Today. Today, I confront you. I confront, I confront you, you. I confront in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The name of Jesus. The name of Just Jesus. as David Just as confronted, confronted Goliath, Goliath, the giant. A giant. Today, Today, I come. I come. In, the in the power and the anointing, and the anointing of, the Holy Ghost, of the Holy Ghost, I confront you. I, confront you. I, rebuke, you. I rebuke you. I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. Name you, of spread Jesus. you spread husband. You spread wife. You spread spouse. You, spread spouse. you, spread you incubus spirit. You, you sakabu spirit. You I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. I rebuke you. I rebuke you. Begin to rebuke that demon. I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. 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 I rebuke you out of my life. I rebuke you out of my marriage. I rebuke you out of my destiny. Rabadabada. 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 I rebuke you. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. I rebuke you by the blood. I rebuke in the name of Jesus. I rebuke you by the blood. I rebuke in the name of Jesus. I rebuke you by the blood. I rebuke in the name of Jesus. I rebuke you by the blood. I overcome you by the blood. I overcome you by the blood. I overcome you by the blood. I defeat you by the blood. I dethrone you by the blood. I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. You spirit husband. You spirit husband. You spirit wife. You spirit wife. You incubus. You sacabus. Any agent of darkness any agent that of has darkness married me. That has married and swallowed my marital destiny. And swallowed my marital and my destiny. marital bliss. And my marital bliss. And my marital joy. And my marital joy. In the name of Jesus. 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 I divorce you. I divorce every mind between me and you. Every marriage between me I and break you. the marriage. I break the marriage. I break the marriage. I break the Every marriage. Every spiritual marriage. Every spiritual I break marriage. It I break it now. I break it now. I break it now. And I divorce you. And I divorce you. I break it now. And I divorce you. I break it now. Every marriage. Every marriage. Every marital covenant. Every marital covenant. Every marital covenant. Between, between, me, and between me and you. Between me and I break it. I break it. And I divorce you. I break and divorce you. I break and divorce you. I break and divorce you. I break the covenant. And I divorce you. I break the covenant 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 and I divorce you. In the name of Jesus. 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 I break the covenant of marriage. I break the covenant of marriage. I break the promise of marriage. I break the covenant of marriage. And I divorce you. And I divorce you. And I divorce you. You spread husband. You spread wife. You spread husband. You spread wife. I break your covenant with me. And I divorce you. I divorce you. I divorce you. I divorce you in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus. 
Say, I break my covenant with you. I break my covenant. And I divorce you. And I divorce you. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Every certificate of marriage. Every certificate of marriage. Of marriage. Of marriage. Between me and the spirit husband. Between me and the spirit husband. And the spirit wife. And the spirit wife. Let the certificate of marriage. Let the certificate of marriage. Catch fire. Catch fire. And burn it to ashes. And burn it to ashes. Every certificate of marriage. Every certificate of marriage. Between me. Between and me. any unclean spirit, and unclean spirit that says they are married to me, that says that they are married. Let to that me. certificate of marriage, let that certificate of be marriage consumed by fire. Be consumed by fire. Every wedding gown, every wedding gown, every wedding gown, every wedding gown, every wedding veil, every wedding veil between me and the spirit husband. Between me and the spirit husband, let it be consumed by fire. Let it be consumed by fire. Every wedding ring, every wedding ring that has been put on my finger, that has been put on my finger, representing, representing spiritually, spiritually that I'm married, that I'm married to any spiritual entity, that I'm married to any spiritual let entity. Let it break. Let it break and be consumed by fire. And be consumed by Say fire. in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I command. I command the wedding ring. The wedding ring. The wedding gown. The wedding gown. And the wedding ring. And the wedding ring. The wedding gown. The wedding gown. And the wedding certificate. And the wedding to certificate. Catch, fire. catch fire. Burn it to ashes. Burn it to ashes. Catch fire. Catch fire. Burn, it ashes. Burn it to ashes. Burn it to ashes. Back at fire. Catch fire. Burn it to ashes. ashes. Catch fire. fire. Burn it to ashes. ashes. Catch fire. fire. Burn it to ashes. Catch fire. Every wedding certificate. Every wedding ring, every wedding certificate, every wedding gun, catch fire, burn it to ashes, 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 by fire, 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 burn it to ashes, burn it to ashes, burn it to ashes, burn it to ashes, burn it to ashes. Burn it to ashes, burn it to ashes, burn it to ashes, burn it to ashes, wedding rings, burn it to ashes, wedding gown, burn it to ashes, wedding way, wedding ring, wedding gown, burn it to ashes, burn it to ashes, burn it to ashes, fire by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire of the Holy Ghost, by fire of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say, you spirit husband. You spirit husband. You spirit wife. You spirit wife. You demon. You demon. That comes to rape me. That comes to rape that me. That claims me as your husband. That claims me as your That claims husband. me as your wife. That claims me as that your wife. That is blocking me for marriage. That is blocking me for marriage. That is causing divorce and separation. That is causing divorce that and separation. That is causing frustration of my destiny. That is causing frustration of that my destiny. That is crippling me financially. That is crippling me financially. That is causing me to be single and lonely. That is causing me to be single and that lonely. That has deposited fibroid in my stomach. That has deposited fibroid in my stomach. That is manipulating and controlling my menstrual cycle. That is manipulating and controlling my menstrual cycle. Causing me to be bleeding excessively. Causing me to be bleeding excessively. Causing me to be having issues of blood every month. Causing me to have issues of blood every month. Causing me to be experiencing nightmares in my dreams. Causing me to be experiencing nightmares in my dreams. You spirit husband. You spirit husband. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Your time has come. Your time has come. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I command you. I command you. Fall down and die. Fall down and die. Fall down and perish. Fall down and die. Fall down and perish. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Fall down and die. Fall down and perish. Begin to pray. Fall down and die. You spirit husband. Fall down and die. Fall down and perish. Fall down and die. Fall down and perish. Fall down and die. In the name of Jesus. Every spirit husband. Every spirit wife. Fall down and die. Fall down and perish. Fall down and die. Fall down and die. Fall down and perish. Fall down and die. Fall down and perish. Fall down and die. Fall down and perish. In the name of Jesus. Whoever you are, you spirit husband. You spirit and Fire by that, die by fire, die by fire. You spirit husband, you spirit wife, you equal you sacrifice, you evil altar, mind to the sons and daughters of Zion. Die by fire, fall down and die, fall down and die, fall down and die, fall down and perish, fall down and die. Fall down and perish. We subdue and destroy you by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, fall down and die, fall down and perish. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name. Amen.
Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every sickness. Every sickness. They have deposited in me. They have de deposited in me. Every fibroid. Every fibroid. They have deposited in me. They have deposited in me. Every snake. Every snake. They have deposited in me. They have deposited in whatever me. Whatever spirit. Whatever spirit. Whatever residue. Whatever residue. Whatever deposit. Whatever deposit. That the spirit husband. That the spirit husband has deposited in me. That has deposited in me. Through their spams. Through their spams. Any spiritual children. Any spiritual children they have given to me. They have given to me. Let them die by fire. Let them die by fire. Let them be destroyed by fire. Let them be destroyed by Any fire. Any fibroid. Any fibroid. Be consumed by fire. Be consumed by fire. Every snake. Every snake. Be consumed by fire. Be consumed by fire. You know why some of them begin to have miscarriage and begin to have barrenness because they release some of the spirit spouses come in the form of snake, and they lodge at your how do you call it your your abdomen abdomen. abdomen feeding on your eggs so every time it is time for conception they eat the eggs and then you can't become pregnant they they release them as a spouse they release them as a snake on your abdomen and then they also begin to feed on your blood through menses menstrual so some of you have been having some severe menses menstrual pains menstrual pains or excessive bleeding it is that snake of the spirit spouse still birth miscarriage that spirit that snake lodging on your belly is going to die by fire it's going to die and then they also now begin to give you spiritual babies their spiritual babies are fibroid or they've given you spiritual babies in the spiritual realm so you can't have physical babies you are going to pray that any evil deposits any whether evil it deposits. is a snake a fibroid menstrual menses painful menstrual cycle, barrenness they have placed on you, let it be consumed by fire. In the name of Jesus, you are going to pray this prayer. Say, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every deposit. Every evil deposit. In my abdomen. In my abdomen. In my stomach. In my stomach. Using it to block my fallopian tube. Using it to block my fallopian tube. My uterus. Tube. My uterus. Causing menses. Causing menses. Painful menstruation. Painful menstruation. Causing fibroid. Causing fibroid. Causing barrenness. Causing barrenness. Infertility. Infertility. Spiritual babies. Spiritual babies. Every damage. Every damage. They have done to my body. They have done to my As body. I begin to pray. As I begin to Let pray. the Holy Ghost fire. Let the Holy Ghost fire. Burn it into ashes. 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 I want you to put your right hand. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I dip my right hand. I dip my right hand in the blood of Jesus. In the blood of Jesus. I dip my right hand. I dip my right in hand in the fire of God. In the fire of God. As I touch my stomach. As I touch my stomach. As I touch my belly. As I touch my belly. Let the fire of God. Let the fire of God enter into my stomach. Enter into my and stomach. Enter into my abdomen. Enter into my abdomen and begin and begin to burn it to ashes. To burn it. To burn ashes. it to ashes. To burn it. To Every ashes. evil deposit. Every evil deposit by the spirit husband. By the spirit husband. By the spirit husband. By the spirit wife. Holy, Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Burn it to ashes. 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 Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Burn it to ashes. Holy Ghost fire. Burn it to ashes. In the name of Jesus. 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 Holy Ghost fire. 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 Burn it to ashes. Burn it to ashes. Burn it to ashes. Burn it to ashes. Every spirit husband. Every spirit wife. Every incubus. Every succubus. Every demonic spirit. Burn them into ashes. Burn it to ashes. Burn it to ashes. Every fibroid. Burn it to ashes. Burn it to ashes. Every barrenness. Every infertility. Burn it to ashes. Every serpentine spirit. Every snake demon. Burn it to ashes. Every spiritual babies. Every spiritual babies. Burn it to ashes. Every spiritual eggs, burn it to ashes. Every spams, burn it to ashes. By the spirit husband, burn it to ashes. Every spirit husband, inside of my body, come up by fire. Come up by fire. 
covered by fire 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 break and go break and go break and lose me break and go break and lose me break and go break and go break and go out by fire out by fire out by fire out by fire in jesus name Somebody, you already feel like vomiting. It's coming out. It's coming out. Something is coming out of you. Something. A deposit. A residue. A deposit. Something is coming. Something is breaking out of you. Yes, yes, yes. You feel like coughing. You feel like vomiting. You feel like ver- ver- verping. Come, It's coming out. I command that spirit in you. Come out. Break and come out. Break and come out. Break and come out. Break and come out. Cough it out. Cough it out. Yes, 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 yes. Somebody, you feel something. Your, 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 your abdomen and your stomach squeezing. Yeah, that spirit. That spirit is coming out. It's coming out. It's coming out. Just begin to break out. Just begin to cough out. Break and come out. Yes, cough it out. Break and come out. Come out. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, some of you are, are, are shaking uncontrollably because the spirit is coming out. It's coming out. It's coming out. The fire of God is all over you. The fire of deliverance is all over you. Yes, yes. Break and come out. Break and come out. That fibroid is coming out. Somebody, a fibroid is coming out of you even right now. You will be rushing to the restroom because a fibroid is dropping. A fibroid is coming out of you in the name of Jesus. The yoke of barrenness. Break and come out. Break and come out. Break and come out in the name of Jesus. Yes, yes, yes. Every month you've been bleeding excessively. It is coming out in the name of Jesus. It is coming out in the name of Jesus. That barrenness yoke, that barrenness curse, breaks in the name of Jesus. Your 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 fallopian tube is being opened. You will break through in marriage. You will break through in pregnancy. You will break through in life in marriage in the name of Jesus Christ. Break and come out. Every spirit husband, every spirit wife, every incubus sacabus that has held people in bondage. I command you in the name of the Lord God Almighty, in Jesus' name. Come out in Jesus' name. Cough out and go. Cough out and go. Vomit and go. Cough out, beep and go. Wherever, however you came in, come out. Some of you feel like using the restroom. You feel like using the restroom. You feel like using the restroom. Things are going to come out of you. Things are going to come out of you. They'll come out of your ears. Come out of your mouth. Come out. You feel like shedding tears. You feel like beeping, coughing, yawning. Some of you, some things will come out of your private. Your, you, you have to use the restroom. However it is, the evil unclean spirit is coming out by the fire of the Holy Ghost, by the power of the Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus. Break and come out. Yes, cough it out, cough it out, cough it out, cough it out. It's coming out. Bep it out. Yet, in the name of Jesus Christ, don't hold it, don't hold it. It's coming out. Yes, it seems as though something is moving in your stomach. That's a pentine demon from the marine kingdom. Break and come out. Break and come out. Break and come out in Jesus' name. Loose them, loose them, loose the sons and daughters of Zion. Loose her in Jesus' name. Loose him in Jesus' name. Loose her in Jesus' name. Loose him in Jesus' name. Loose her in Jesus' name. Loose him in Jesus' name. Yes, 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 yes. Cough it out, burp out. Cough out, sneeze out. Yes, however, it's coming out. Let it go. 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 Flash out of them in Jesus' name. Break from today that attack of evil dream will stop now. That spirit that comes to visit you in your bedroom, that comes to sleep by you, they will not come again. That excessive bleeding every month in your monthly cycle stops in the name of Jesus. You are, you are delivered. You are set free. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. He who the Son set free is free indeed. Today, by the power of the Holy Ghost, I command your liberty, your freedom. Some of you will still feel like coughing, vomiting, using the bathroom, let the Holy Spirit cleanse you. Let the Holy Spirit flash them out of you in Jesus' name. But you are being set loose. You are being set free. You are being set loose. You are being set free. You are being set loose. You are being set free. You will marry to the glory of God in Jesus' name. I pray for your restoration. I pray for your restoration. Whatever blessing, whatever blessing, whatever honor, whatever dignity, whatever prestige, whatever honor, prosperity, whatever marital bliss, whatever peace, whatever joy, whatever children, whatever blessing the spirit spouse, the spirit husbands took from you, be restored in Jesus' name. Amen. Be restored in Jesus' name. Amen. Be restored in Jesus' name. As the spirit breaks out of you and goes, be restored. Be restored. Amen. Be restored. Amen. Be restored. Amen. Be restored. Amen. Whatever they stole from you, whatever they took from you, you are being restored. Your marriage is being restored. Your health is being restored. Your marital destiny is being restored. Your finances is being restored. Your glory is being restored. Your dignity is being restored in the name of Jesus. This time around, you will get married and nothing can stop you in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. 
we bless you amen and amen thank amen. you lord it is done it is done somebody because of you the lord says we should go this direction please during this 40 days fasting always go to this video again and be consistent enforcing mm. you are going to what enforce okay. your deliverance you've been delivered but the bible says wait when this unclean spirit goes they come back trying to see whether you are empty that's why you have to make sure you are surrounding yourself with the word of god the holy spirit and you are also keeping on praying so when the israelites when pharaoh allowed the israelites to come out of egypt he wanted to go back and keep them back in bondage he wanted to bring them back and therefore they had to what, be aggressive so make sure that you spend time reading the word make sure you are born again make sure your holy spirit filled that's what i'm saying get the books read them and enforce your deliverance i will advise you all throughout this 40 days fasting visit these prayers and also use the book i've written freedom from generational case it will help you enforce your deliverance get the book emergency prayers for my restoration you'll get all the symptoms and all the prayers also in this book, emergency prayers for marriage restoration. And also the third one is consuming fire for fire. One demon, you see, we need a lot of materials to deal with it. And the word of God constantly. These three books, consuming fire for fire, that's what we did. And also from the book, emergency prayers for marriage restoration and also freedom from generational care. Get them on our website, www.freshfireprayer.com, www.freshfireprayer.com. It shall be sent, it will be sent to your email and then you start reading it and be delivered in jesus name we give glory and honor and praise i would advise somebody to sow a seed sow a seed because some of these spirits have come because of covenant and pact and sacrifice made by our ancestors linking us father by this sacrifice by this offering by this sacrifice let this deliverance that i have received today tonight this morning this afternoon let it be permanent let it be what permanent as so i sow this sacrificial seed let the stronghold of this strong man be broken off my life so your sacrifice seed and ask the lord to deliver you from the crutches from the grapes of this strong man in jesus mighty name go to the website and you can sow your seed www.freshfireprayer.com if it's cash up www.freshfireprayer.com cash up is fresh fire prayer all the donation information is on our website Amen. And the books also on the website. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Join us tomorrow at 11 p.m. Eastern Time, U.S., 4 a.m. London, 5 a.m. Europe. Our scripture reading for tomorrow is John chapter 18. John chapter 18 is our scripture reading for tomorrow. Please take advantage of this and... If you have your communion, take your communion. If you have your communion, those of you who have your communion, we seal our deliverance mm -hmm. by the blood of Jesus. We mm -hmm. seal what? Our, our deliverance today by what? The by the blood. blood. Today, by the blood, I disconnect you from the spirit husband. As you take the communion, you say, I seal deliverance with the precious blood of Jesus. And by the precious blood, I disconnect myself from the spirit spouse, spirit husband in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. amen. Take advantage. Take advantage of the one night deliverance one night deliverance coming up next week friday meet me next week friday in delaware for another session of deliverance so those of you who will be coming join me next week friday for a one night deliverance section in life chapel international the address is 22 parkway circle 22 parkway circle city is newcastle delaware the zip code is 19720. The time is 8.30 p.m. Come and take your front seat. Come. If you don't come early, you'll not get any place to stay. You'll be staying behind, sitting at the back. So come in. Come in early. No registration is needed. No registration needed. Come with your friends. Come with your family. Come with your loved ones and experience the power of God's deliverance. February 24th, next week, Friday. The time is 8.30. Any further information and details about the conference, call the number 484-650-4459. 484-650-4459. Amen. Anybody who experienced deliverance tonight as we're praying, just uh, type, I did, I did. And you can type your experience. If you were burping, some of you were coughing, some of you had to rush to the restroom, some of you were experiencing some squeezing, and pain at your abdomen yeah god was breaking the power and the grips of that strong man out of you 
something happened to you tonight. Believe you're, you've received your deliverance. Believe some of you were vomiting, some of you were coughing, some of you were burping, some of you were yawning, some of you, there was a sensation going on even in your private because the spirits were coming out. Whatever it is, you are being delivered. You got to believe it. Just go back and reinforce. Go back and reinforce your deliverance go back and reinforce go back and reinforce your deliverance keep your head in the bible keep your head in the bible and get the books i've recommended be reading them be praying them and you are free indeed and you are going to see the manifestation of now you getting married you getting pregnant you no more painful menses no more going through all these attacks in jesus name also sow your sacrificial seed and seal the deal in the name of jesus christ and it shall be well with you god richly bless you god willing i'll meet you tomorrow bye 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 god bless you everyone